Hey. Hey. Surprised to see you here. I work here. Well, I just figured you'd be at the wedding by now. So, um, do you have some time before you have to be at the church? Don't do that. Say what? Get any ideas. Don't get any ideas. There are no ideas here. I don't have any ideas, okay? This is, I'm just making small talk. Okay, well, don't do that. Why not? Because I'm busy. I'm working. Okay. I'm busy. I'm working, too. I'm not trying to be mean. I just... I don't want you to get too attached. I have three children, a big job. Okay, you jump me. Okay, not that I minded. It was good. We had a good time. It was very good. I don't know about you, but that was some of my best work. And in a car, which is not easy. But now what? Now you think, what? You're my sun on my moon? That all of a sudden I think that the stars shine down on only you? That you touched me and the heavens open? And I'm blinded by the angel that is you? And you're good, but nobody's that good. I did jump you, didn't I? Yeah, you did. <laughs> okay, well, point taken. You are not after me. I am not after you. We are friends who maybe have sex. We're friends who had sex once. Uh, we're friends that had sex four times in one night, but this don't get picky. Crab and I were... Anyway, the kid's alive. Oh, well, that's great news. Okay, now you're the one being the jerk. Well, because Alex was right about you. Oh, yes, of course, because everybody's always in your ear telling you what to think about me, Nobody Maggie. Nobody tells me what to think. Okay, good, because I don't want their opinion. Okay, I care about what you think. About you? Actually, I think a lot of okay, No, 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 no. No banter. No more quips. I'll tell you what I think. I think about you a lot. Okay, I can't stop. I'm telling you, I am in. If you are, I'm in this. So I'm just, I'm just gonna ask you outright. What do you think? Actually, don't answer. Not till you know. When you do, just give me a call. They say sing what you know. I don't have a good reason. I try to come up with one. So then I thought, well, why do I like her? And I don't know. From the first time I saw you, you were at the OR board, you were talking with Pierce, and she said something that made you laugh. And I couldn't move. And then I had to wait for you to write your name on the board because I just needed to know who you were. So I, I don't have... A good reason for you to like me. I didn't even try to like you. I didn't want to. And I certainly don't want to have to think about you all the time, trying to come in early, see your name on the board come up with that one thing that's gonna make you smile so your eyes do that thing they do anyway uh so that's why i joke so much and to keep from having to say anything like this <laughs> so i don't have a good reason i'm sorry i wish i did okay so you should ask me out to dinner Do you want to go out to dinner? Yes. Dr. Gray, Dr. Pierce needs you. Okay. Sorry. Tonight, Sabrina's restaurant. Sorry? Let's go have a drink and have a conversation. Like a date? No, it's not a date. It's two people hanging out to see if we enjoy hanging out before I tell Maggie. 
Oh, so when it goes well, then you'll tell Meg. It could go either way. We could end up hating each other, and then there would be nothing to tell. You don't hate me. I could hate you. I have before. Eight o'clock. It's a date. It's not a date. We got to the conference? I think I've learned enough. Hmm. Thanks. I don't even know what town we're in. Sioux Falls, apparently. Right. Well, they gotta have a nice hotel. Well, if it's not nice, it's gonna be halfway decent. Look, we're stuck here. We gotta sleep. But not together. Oh, you, you just you just treated a bloke's brain bleed with a cocktail straw. You're so fearless about so many things. How the hell are you still scared? I'm not scared. One of the most unpredictable things about encountering turbulence is its aftermath. I'm making a choice. I'm prioritizing my family, my sister. No, don't, don't, please. Don't pretend this is still about Pierce. It's not. You're scared. Of what? Of him. Letting him go. Where is Gary? Gary! No! Everything's been shaken up, undone, turned on its head. At some point, you gotta let go. I don't really want to talk about this. You're good. I don't want to talk. I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk at all. Okay? I just want to. I want to move forward. I want to live my life because I'm still here. I've still got one, and so do you. Don't look at me like that. Like, I don't know what I'm talking about, because you know I do. That could have been you in that seat with no seatbelt. Yeah, but it wasn't. Okay, I'm just fine. So are you. So if you have the choice to avoid the plane crash, do you take it? Do you play it safe? Be a nice hotel. Or do you get on board and take your chances? Is it a four star hotel? Five star? I mean, how nice are we talking? I'm not holding your hand. 